Hi, I'm Real Genetic Demon, and this is Gallagher and Galaxians on the Game Boy. Well, actually, it's on the Super Game Boy, which is in my Super Nintendo. And as you can see, already, it's got an enhanced background, so it changes the standard background from sort of what looks like a Game Boy to something different. So, so, And it's also got graphics and colours and things like that. Isn't that cool? I have to admit, that's quite cool. I think it's cool. Anyway, so let's start with Gallagher, and we'll see what Gallagher looks like on the enhanced version here. So this is a shoot 'em up from 1981. Um, let's get this on. Oh, some music. Do 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 I like Gallagher. I'm quite quite a fan of Gallagher actually. It's it's just a it's just a it's just a good little shoot 'em up. It looks nice on the oh to be fair, it looks very nice on the enhanced version on the Super Game Boy. Yeah, very nice and enhanced, very playable actually, very smooth. I'm sure that on the normal Game Boy it would be just as good, actually, to be honest with you. But we can see all these additional colours here and all of the bits and pieces gone with the, the enhanced sort of um, knowing that it was on the Super Game Boy. And giving access to the, the, the graphics and colours that are available from the Super Nintendo device itself. Yeah, good shoot 'em up. Always a good shoot 'em up. And I've been, as I say, I've been. Uh, if you've not been watching some of the other ones, I've been doing quite a few of the shoot 'em ups on the the, the 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 Game Boy, just the black and white ones, seeing what they do. Um, you can't play the color Game Boy on a, a super a super a super Game Boy um, module because effectively it's a Game Boy in a in a cartridge. Isn't that clever? They just put the whole thing into the cartridge and just so that you can play it on your your and then use and then effectively put put the outputs through your telly into a nice little box and things like that. It's quite good. Oh! I'm doing rubbish there. I do like a bit of Gallagher, though. Ready? Yes, I am. Let's go for it. We played it on the Arcade Challenge, if I remember rightly. Turned out to be quite tough for, for some of us. Get extra points for getting them when they're Spinning round, BB. Got him. Challenge stage. I can't remember what the challenge stage is. Oh, yeah, you just have to clear it out, don't you? It's one of these things that's so enduring, isn't it, Gallagher? It's, it's you know, even the kids nowadays have seen Gallagher. You've, uh, we've all we've all seen it as as, as sort of a, a, a game that's always kind of been there. It's a bit like Space Invaders. It's very enduring as a, a sort of uh, a style of, of shoot 'em up that's there. I like the echoing sound effect. I wonder if that's been enhanced again by the by the Super Game Boy. Could possibly be. Oh, they got me good and proper there. That was me, dead, deaded. It's good though. Did all right. Let's see if we can go back to the menu and we'll try Galaxians. Excellent. Should be able to press a button to go back to the menu. I hope. Uh, let's see. No, that's not the button I want to press. That's starting me again. I may have to turn it off and on again, push the reset button, and then you'll see it actually do its little thing, which is cool, cool. Oh! Oh, hang on! I didn't know what that was that was there. Oh, it's the pallets! You can push all these buttons for the Super Game Boy. I had no idea where they were there. If you press the t the two the top the L R and the L whatever else button it is, you get all of the options for it, and also you can define the pads. I'm not sure what I would want to color the whole thing, but basically I can color the backgrounds. Excellent. Don't know why I would want to do any of that. That's not what I want to do. Let's see if I can cancel this out of there. If I push all four buttons together, will that work? Yes, all four buttons together works. If you press the start, select, and the two buttons, it works to take you out of it. I never knew about those buttons there. I must have a look at those, because I can change the colours on the backgrounds, can't I? I can make them look fancier in some of the games that I've been doing. It's kind of cool. I never got the box for my Super Game Boy, by the way. I just got it as a, as a, a sort of freebie with it. Oh, another background as well. Here we go, Galaxians. This is more like Space Invaders, if I'm honest, this one, in, any, in, in its styling. Except for the fact they come down at you and try and hit you. 
And you get extra points, I think, if you kill them when they come down. Yeah, more more like Space Invaders. Another classic. I, I sit and play this on my Evercade, actually. I'm very pleased. Uh, it's one of those games that I'm very kind of keen on um, doing. I'll have to I'll have to look through the the options for 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 um, the the the, um, the 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 Super Game Boy now that I know that they're there. Simple is sometimes the best in my book, and if you remember, this is eight bit gaming. So so this is this is this is you know the the, the that generation. Ah, oh, got him! Whoa, that was close. That sort of gener that, that sort of early generation games, you know, the the eighties, the end of the eighties anyway for the Game Boy, fantastic bit of kit. I mean, so clever, um, so simple. No need to go to go fancy. And it's always been, it's almost been, it's almost been Nintendo's, um, you know, uh, 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 thing to. And, and although they ba broke some boundaries, it's almost been their thing to not go too far with the hardware because it sort of saves time and uh, you know, and you don't have to worry about what you're actually getting. I mean, the the whole. Switch itself, of course, is being a, um, a, a, a Tegra processor, um, you know, seen as last generation for everything else. And they don't even they don't even attempt to compete in the same market. They, they, they the only market they compete in is Nintendo's, which is which is a, it's an odd statement to make, but it is. It's the only market they actually compete in. And something like this, is just just brilliant. I do I do wish there was a I do wish they would do a Game Boy though. I, I would like to see a Game Boy. Um, sort of remake if they do one. I know they've done the, they've done the, uh, they've done the, um, the, the mini, and they've done the, the, the sort of the, the, the various other ones that they've got. But I would love to see them do a Game Boy one because I've always been a big fan of the Game Boy. And I've got another life because I've, I've shot down enough stuff that I've got another life. No score on the screen because there's no space for it basically. Oh, it's good. It's a good version. This actually very good, very playable indeed. Get your Game Boy out. Get your emulator out. Not that Nintendo likes that, but you know, do all that kind of stuff and give it a try. It's good. Namco game. This one actually. Oh, that's me all over. Stage three. It stopped me at stage three. That was really good. I really enjoyed that. I hope you did too. Um, definitely worth picking up. Definitely worth trying. Definitely worth playing. Galacticans and Galaga. On the on the Game Boy, um, and if you've got a Super Game Boy, it looks really nice. It's quite fancy, really. Anyway, I'll see you soon. Thank you. Bye bye.